Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Askins. Wow, I am not used to that. Uh, tonight, uh, welcome back to Lumber Tycoon 2. Um, tonight, I'm going to be trying something a little bit different. I wanted to turn off my, um, my uh, green screen so you guys could see my actual room because everybody's been like, go oh, do, a, do a house tour, blah, blah, blah. I'm not, I'm not going to do a house tour, but I would love to show you my actual room. Um, because it's going to be um, imperative that you know what my room looks like and what I'm going to be showing you in VR later. So, um, let's see here. Is there... Yes, there we go. Okay, can we can we stretch this out at all? Fade, 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 fade. Beautiful. Okay, first off... Oh, don't break, don't break, don't break. <clears throat> right here is my, my green screen. And this is, this is how I actually hook it up. I have a little thing. So whenever I, I pull my green screen across, I have to turn off my fan. And then right back there, whoa. Uh, as you can see, I've got like gamer things all over the place. That right there, um, if you look, where's my finger? That's the original Nintendo. It's got a power glove and a zapper on top. I've got a Super Nintendo, uh, Nintendo 64 right there the nintendo wii uh that is a purple heart for my grandfather not me uh, i've got the playstation original playstation 2 and what, what that is oh it's a harry potter lunchbox but it's got military stuff in it like all my old ranks and stuff uh and then i've got the original xbox the xbox 360 and then my play button um the reason that you're not seeing the current consoles up there like the playstation 4 uh, the Xbox One, stuff like that, is because they're actually hooked up and I'm using them. So, oh, by the way, I also have the Nintendo Switch right down there. That's that's my computer, by the way. All hooked up. And I ordered a new computer, so you guys are going to see the new machine as well. Um, on my wall, I've got Now You're Playing With Power. It's one of the original Nintendo um, NES. And then... That's the original Mortal Kombat. Uh, came from the Super Nintendo. And that's the actual one too. Ow, it's got all the, the marks. And then I've got um, that right there, which is the uh, Sonic 2 Game Pro. Uh, very famous. And yes, all of these posters are from Nintendo, Super Nintendo. Uh, sorry, from Nintendo Power Magazine. And then I've got the actual um, Legend of Zelda, the first one, that's the map. This one is Hyrule uh, from Super Nintendo, that's their map. And posters like Link, stuff like that. Anyhow, I wanted you to kind of see my actual setup, my room. This is my office, this is my room. Uh, it's my man cave, I guess, because um, I used to be in the garage. And if you guys haven't seen some of the older videos and stuff like that, I actually have an entire thing. Oh gosh, also a nice bridge. I'll uh, go now. Wait, what? Wait, is that the actual jingle? Hold up, is that jingle? <gasps> jingle, what's up buddy? Jingle, wait, jingle. <laughs> Code, can I buy off you? Uh, I don't sell, sorry. <laughs> Hi, I exist. <laughs> um, yeah, we're, we're going to be doing some spooky wood tonight. I, I want to go searching for some spook wood. But uh, I want to put my bridge down first. Oh, the bridge is, is the bridge down? The bridge is already down. No need. Boom. We'll get straight into it and start, start looking for spook wood. Oh gosh, what happened? Oh. For some reason, these these things are just happening like that. Where's everybody at? Hi, Jingle. Hi. Oh, you got the Ready Player Two thing, dude. This this VR thing that I found, it's called um, MUVR. E M U V R. Um, hey, whose pot is this? How much are they? I will buy an I. I don't sell. I don't sell. <laughs> Jingle's gonna beat us up there, isn't he? 
Anyhow, um, it's called MU VR, and basically inside the VR, hi buddy. He, uh, they made emulators inside a VR. Inside, it's like a, a room. It looks like my room, um, back from like the '90s, but it's. I keep looking over here, but it's uh, it's got consoles inside of it. Like you can you can load any console that is downloadable in em emulator style. Which I should probably have disclaimer. You can't download ROMs and stuff legally. That's yeah, copyright stuff. But anyhow. Emulators. It's a it's a complete 90s room uh, And if you have your own videos and stuff like that, it has a VHS player and some of the old-school um, Like VHS players and TVs and all kinds of crazy stuff. Anyhow <sighs> That's what kind of prompted me to not put on my green screen tonight, and I th I think I like it. I like it without the green screen because it gets to show off my, my little room. Anyhow. Uh, this is this is one of the advantages of being an adult. I can spend my money on stupid stuff and nobody cares. <laughs> well, I mean, some, somebody cares. My wife probably cares, but it's fine. It's good. I'll give 10 many axes for, for what? Hello? Does ha tread? Uh, you should totally whitelist me. You can totally trust me too. <laughs> All right, whitelist jingle. There you go, buddy. Jingle's whitelisted. Totally whitelisted. I don't know. I'm not watching. <laughs> don't be mean. <laughs> Hope this isn't your car. What? No. All right. Oh gosh, I'm stuck. Anyhow, um, if you do pixel art inside Lumber, I would love to see some original Nintendo pixel art. Uh, I know there's a couple of people that have done some amazing pixel art. So, tweet me. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. I don't really post to Instagram, but... Oh, follow me on Twitter, at CodePrimate. What am I doing? We're looking for Spookwood. I'm not seeing any Spookwood around. I'm your biggest fan. Thanks, DJ. Uh, wait. Pain, I have no cash. What? My car now. Never mind. I don't know what he's doing. He's being crazy. Okay. Okay. Why is there a silver axe over here? If somebody's like ruining my base or doing something over there, that would be horrible. So bad. Oh, 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 get on there. Get on there. There you go. Hi, Bob. <laughs> Hi. I'll take it. Ah, exploiter. Okay. Thanks. Ah, uh, jump out. Okay. Hang tight, I'll get into another server. Oh, I, I guess I could, I can pause it. There we go. <laughs> huh, I am? Yes, you was.
No, no. You just just saved my base. <laughs> well, they're asking, are you going to do jumpy jump? All right, am I hopping? Well, I was, but now I'm going to have to go play in a private server. To new to lumber. Oh, winky face. Bye. All right, I'll jump out. Whoa! Did you guys did you guys see that? Did you see? I saw that. Go back just a couple of seconds in the video, and it was uh, the VIP room, but it, it it was out in the open. Dude, that was awesome. I've I've never seen it in person before. I've never seen it like live. But that was totally Defaultio's VIP room. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, man. You guys can tell that my uh, headphones have been through some years. Look, I mean, look at this. It's like falling apart. I think it might be time for me to get a new set of headphones. <clears throat> Maybe paint them up gold. Hi, Jingo. Wanna stay and play? Mm, excuse me, I burpy burped. So, how's life, lol? <laughs> oh, yeah, you can stay for a bit if you want. It's fine. Okay. <sighs> Now that we're in different time zones. You're totally exploiting. See that? See that? I saw that jingle. School exists. <laughs> look, look, I'm flying. I'm flying. Exploiter. I'm just kidding. It, the camera's not right there. It's over here. Oh, that's throwing me off. <laughs> Select. Confirm. So, what do you think of the new fast load system he made. Man, that chat is laggy. Wonder, wonder how much stuff he got or what he was messing with. Because I don't remember having a silver axe on my base. I mean, most all of them I converted over into uh, Twitter axes. He, he should make the Twitter axe a thing again. I wonder why he blocked it off so we can get Twitter axes. Gotta pass all them exams and get to good grades, so I don't, so I don't fail my classes and lose everything I've been working for since I got into life in the first place. What? I think it's pretty good. Uh, it isn't incredible, but like 50% improvement. Agreed. And yeah, you need to go to school so you can get that good job. Because we all know YouTube doesn't pay. <laughs> you could totally become a full-time YouTuber, just saying. Okay. Now. I know that it's not going to be here yet, but I will absolutely try and, well, try and go find a, uh, oh. 
I will try and go find a spook tree. We'll, we'll still do spook wood hunting and, and trying for it, but... <clears throat> now I should be able to do this, hold on. Menu, whitelist, jingle. Whitelist. Me about to purchase a vehicle with money I've gained from YouTube. <laughs> Very true. Now, over the course of like the lifetime of my channel, I probably could have bought a car, but I've never separated out the money from YouTube versus um, regular job, right? Which was bad on my part. I probably should have done that at first. It wasn't close enough. Not close enough. Oh no. Okay. So let's uh let's totally do the glitch. That one. Alright, we're gonna do rotate. Oh, oh, oh come on, rotate. And rotate. Rotate skills. Got it. Okay, so normally whenever you're hunting for wood, you'd come over here and check. Um, instead of me just talking about the hunt for the entire time, let's talk about school. You know, there's a, a lot of people who, um, didn't go to school last year you, like you did uh, learn at home or you didn't get to go in a physical classroom so I know that there's a lot of people who are still just done with wearing a mask I mean even even me I'm I'm done wearing a mask I hate wearing a mask if there's a, a store that says hey you don't need a mask inside I don't wear one because I've got the shot and I know that I'm not going to get it um, and that's not entirely true, because from what I'm hearing with the Delta variant and all that jazz of the, uh, the virus, apparently if I don't get a booster shot, I could possibly get it again. I mean, and I'm okay with getting shots and booster shots and all that. Like, I approve of it. I'm okay with it. I, I'm very much a believer in the vaccinations. So... And there's some people who aren't, you know, if you're, if your parents aren't, or if you yourself aren't, you know, that is completely 100% your opinion. Absolutely. You can believe whatever you want. You can, you can, whoa, what was that? Oh, that is a cool shadow. You know what? I'll stay to the end of the recording unless you record for another hour or so, but I can live with seven hours of sleep. Cool. We are... We are halfway done. I'm 19 minutes in. Which, I mean, it goes really fast. The, the recordings, and especially when you're doing like collaborations and stuff, they just go so quick. It does not feel like 30 minutes. But... <clears throat> yes. But I know that it's not going to spawn in time in a, uh, in a private server. But I still do the search. Talking about COVID ATM. <clears throat> oh, did you want to voice chat? I can totally start up a voice chat if you want. Ooh. Oh, 
Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> no! Oh gosh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Keep up with the silly. <laughs> I'm I'm totally okay with silly chats and text. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm like super hyper focused on that VR game that I've been playing, the VR room. Like I am definitely one for nostalgia of '90s and stuff like that. Um, especially old school Nintendo, Nintendo 64 stuff like that. It takes me back to when I was young and I'd get the weekends to go and hang out at a friend's house. We'd play video games, we'd uh, make stupid little movies and stuff like that. My friend Aaron down the street, he uh, was one of my best friends growing up and he's the one who uh, snuck into the Christmas presents one year, used an X-Acto knife to open up the, uh, the Game Genie for Super Nintendo. So, you ever heard about the tragedy of Darth Plagius the Wise? No? Man, those Jedi people stink. What? <laughs> I think he's talking nerd. Sorry, obscure Star Wars reference. Ignore me. If anybody got that, you know, comment down below. Jingle, I got it. Hashtag Jedi. Wee. <laughs> Hello there. Hello there. <laughs> Oh gosh, that's not good. That's not good. Get out! Get out! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, lost. General Kenobi. Only true Star fan, Star Wars fans would understand. Oh, I'm chuckling. Chuckling. I'm chuckling. <laughs> Chuckling, chuckling. I spelled it wrong though. Anyhow, what was I saying? Something about um, comment a Star Wars meme in the comments for me. See, totally. We will rate each other's Star Wars memes. I think we're about to die. Oh ha ha ha! Skills. Wait, what? I will try to rate one as code. I don't know about you, but like, sure, we live. What? I, 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 I'm not getting it. I don't understand. Man, this is just not my night for the, uh, the rotates, is it? There we go. Oh, <laughs> almost. Ah, skills. <sighs> Anyhow, I know that school can be rough, but you are going to reminisce. Like you're gonna get older. You're gonna get to like my age and you're gonna reminisce about these days. So make the most out of them. You know, if you have a friend's house that you can go and hang out and do slumber parties or sleepovers or whatever you guys call them nowadays, do it. All right. Parents, same thing. Like if you're, if your kids are having to go to school anyway, have them go do slum, slumber parties, sleepovers, you know, one of my favorite memories was, um, it was new year's Eve. My parents were having a new year's party. And um, the 
my friend came over with his parents. His parents got to hang out with my parents, and my my parents had bought us a new game, Who Framed Roger Roger Rabbit for the original Nintendo. That was one of my favorite memories, was sitting down with that new game and us going through it. And it was a slumber party. It was, it was a sleepover. It's fun. So. <sighs> Hanging out downstairs in the basement, playing Dungeons and Dragons till the wee hours of the morning. That was an old school Dungeons and Dragons, like second edition rules. And then they had uh, the the third. We had Thacko. Thacko is horrible. What do you say, guys? Did you know that I was uh, first in one of Code's videos back in 2017? <laughs> Very true. And he's one of the first books that I ever signed. Found him in public server as the Samper Life guy. Aw, oh, Samper Life. I haven't played Samper Life in quite a while. After spooky season, I'll, I'll go play some more. Totally fanboy, Nick Kid West. I don't know what he was doing. I don't know, Jingle. If you, if you guys didn't know, Jingle has actually um, met me twice in, in person. Um, his dad actually got a hold of me on Facebook and said they were going to be in the area. Oh, gosh. Oh, that was close. And uh, I don't know what he was doing. He also got in trouble and grounded for two weeks because of it. Oh, that's right. Anyhow. Um, I've got to meet his parents, got to meet his brothers and sisters, like, just hang out and have a lot of fun, you know? I think that it's an awesome family. And one of the only fans that I've actually met in real life, so... <laughs> <laughs> By the way, thanks for not killing us. He's talking about the the fall down the uh, the back of that mountain. Uh, good times. I like doing YouTube. I like sitting here talking and just making it feel like a personable experience. You know, I d I don't know who you are, and this is what makes it feel weird for me because I've got thousands upon thousands of people who are watching this right now and I don't know you like I know some of you but it's a it's very much a one-way conversation on a YouTube video and I don't really have any way of connecting with you guys except through discords Twitter stuff like that but I hope it doesn't stop. I hope it doesn't deter you from watching the videos, participating in the comments, and just having fun in general. Because I think that's what gaming is all about. Gaming is supposed to bring, bring people together in a social setting, in a social way. And I feel like by not communicating in the comments, I'm missing out on something. You know? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. I feel like gaming is very underrated, and a lot of people don't understand gaming. But maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm I'm the only one that feels that way. But I'm okay with it. And to tell you the truth, a lot of oh gosh, to tell you the truth, a lot of the times, I would just rather play solo on something. You know? Okay, hold on, this isn't working. There we go. Wait, what is he saying? I'd like to wear it to school one day. I'd like to wear what? Fanboying for two weeks. By the way, thanks for not killing us. I uh, thought I should appreciate that. Did I mention that Jack UK still hasn't sent me that hat? I'm fuming. I'd like to wear it to school one day, but now nah, I can't because Jack keeps forgetting to give me it uh, the Amazon gift card 
but oh well. I uh, probably survive. Maybe I'll buy the hat myself, and then I'll buy him a hat too. We'd look, uh, we'd be looking pretty dapper. Not gonna lie. Hey, uh, there we go. Nice shirt, by the way. Were you selling it? This shirt is by uh, Jeremy Kuti. Go to my avatar and look at the shirt. Yes, it is for sale. And here, I'll, I'll also step out so you guys can take a, a good gander at it. That is the shirt. Um, Jeremy had asked me for a high resolution of the the face so you could put it on there. As you can see, it's still low res, but that's just because of Roblox itself. But totally for sale. You guys can go get in the spooky code primate season. And if you happen to have wings, it's like perfectly positioned for the the guy's face on the back. So Oh that's 31 minutes. Uh, do we say goodbye to that cool fourth wall and hide the numerous individual people to their own thoughts and feelings and emotion? Because I love doing that. Wait. Do we say goodbye to that fourth wall? <laughs> True. I mean, that's what we're doing. But I mean, I do that in like all my videos because I'm, I'm addressing you directly. So, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, joined by an exploiter who mainly forced me into my own private server where I got to hang out with this guy, Jingle, and have uh, nice conversations and comic relief in the background. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Uh, oh, be on the lookout for that next video of the VR room because I think it's going to be awesome. Love you guys. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. There it is. Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.